morning, everybody. It's me, San Martin, and Eric Knight. I'm all warm, and Eric looks like he is in summertime still. It's still summertime. It's probably right? because the office is at room temperature. It's, it's warm. Right. Which is nice. Right. I didn't. Are you warm? I'm way more. I, I need to take this off. Maybe when I came back, you're going to have a different look. Maybe. Oh, there you go. Sold. With that being said, let's get this party started. Like this. Welcome to the 863 Morning Show with your host, San Martin Rodriguez and Eric Knight. Okay, dokie, how you doing? How you been? Where you been? What's going on? It's Friday, and guess what? Eric's uh-huh. going to tell you what day this is. It is. All right, it's National Smile Day. Yeah. Yes, there you go. I'm good at that. I'm Friday good at that. smiles. All right. I'm, def- I'm definitely like that because it's Friday. And, and what happens in Friday? I don't know. Does anybody know? I'm waiting to find out. Well, check this out. We have a lot of cool things that are going to be coming up. Obviously, the Prescott uh, area is full of events. And we want to go ahead and share them with you. But first, we got to talk about the weather because you know what? It's going to be an impacting uh, moment for everybody. You know that? Uh, it, it, yesterday was supposed to rain, Eric, and it, it, it did not. It did not. But... So this weekend we're gonna get rain, right? Right. Well, that's what they keep on saying. Let's see it. Well, let's go ahead and check it out real quick. Let's check this out real, real quick because I'm telling you guys, it's like a big deal for us to go ahead and make sure that you know we we tell you guys everything that's going so on. So is it gonna rain today? I don't know. This is the problem that I'm having. It says it's gonna rain. Thirty percent chance. Fifty percent chance tomorrow. Thirty percent chance. On Monday or Sunday. Okay. So it'd be kind of like a cool weekend to be like relax and chill and get all cozied up. But next week is like pretty awesome, but it doesn't look like nothing's going to hit 70. And if it does hit 70, it's still going to be amazing here in Prescott. That's crazy. I was down there, uh, downtown Prescott over at uh, Baron Dragon. Shout out Baron Dragon, Amanda. Today? Uh, yesterday. Oh, yesterday. yesterday. Okay. Um, and um, uh, a couple. Okay. So, so downtown, they have those things that look like parking meters. Yeah, but they're not. Everybody that is not from Prescott, Arizona, was like, "Oh, don't forget to uh, pay the parking meter." And I and I was like, "Wow, that's such a genius idea to go ahead and actually put that out there for for uh, people." Um, and were they putting money in it? They they were trying to put money in it, and okay. they're like, uh, "How does this work?" And I was like, "Hey, no, it's a donation thing." They're like, "Oh, really?" I said, "Yeah, but you only got two hours to go ahead and hang on that spot before you get a ticket." And so, they are on it. Oh my gosh, yeah. they are. So, anyways. It was a moment where I was able to go ahead and say, don't put no money in that. But then put, I started thinking about it. We're like, oh, put no, money in donations. That. Yeah, it helps our community. I don't, right. know who, I don't even know who it goes to. It goes to the homeless. There's actually a story about that a few weeks ago that put on by the city. It goes to the homeless. Okay, so mm-hmm. let's think about the homeless situation. The other day I was talking to an individual. She was saying that she was actually walking into an area over there by the actual uh, – uh, rodeo grounds mm-hmm. and in in this little trail area she goes it it's an encampment there's an encampment in that little hill area and she goes you know it's not a big deal to understand that people can't make it in life but the problem is is that it's like it's they, a neighborhood it's like a trash well, it's, it's like a trash dump for them it is and so i don't know if the city is allowing the homeless to be in those areas they should go ahead and come and do trash collection on them i mean it is what it is either that or they need to set up some trash cans so they could go ahead and, and distribute this, put a trash can out there so they could go ahead and just distribute this trash or they're going to go ahead and ruin it. I don't know. Were you with me when I did that little uh, um, uh, follow up on the, uh, the the homeless encampment that was over there by uh, the Granite Creek Park Granite and Park. the yeah. Um, the res? Yeah. And they moved it. But they, they, no, they 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 took them out. They're right. like, no, because feces was getting put out there. I mean, they should. But that's always put, been. It's been. That's always a hot spot for that. I, I you know, but yeah. there there has to be some sort of balance. If they're going to allow the homelessness to go ahead and have an encampment where they're not paying any bills, anything, but allow them to go ahead and ruin the environment, there's an issue. But the park's always been like that. We joked about the what was it? The old restaurant got burned down by homeless people. Yeah, that were that were in that same area. Yeah. That were the bridge where the the trailer was on the bridge. Speaking of, guess what gets closed this weekend? What? Splash bed. Splash pad. Yep. Oh, yeah, it was, was on yesterday. I was I was shocked to see it was still open, and it is still open. I think until the tenth. So I think Sunday. Yeah, I don't know. So maybe, maybe but, I'll just go jump in there to get a free yeah. free bath. Free bath. <laughs> Sorry. Well, I mean, you're gonna jump in a lake. There you go. Okay. So, yeah. anyways, the story is in my head right now is that you know what? If we're gonna do good for the community, might as well do good for the environment as well, especially the ones that are sitting out there. Uh, 
just camping huh? um, on our dive. Oh, well, and then there was a fire last year that was because people camp out at um, in the National Forest too near town, and they've started a couple of fires too there. So anyway, it's just something to be aware of. I don't think there's an easy solution, but yeah. yeah. Yep, so, yep. All right, what else we got going on? I don't know. Let's let's say good morning. Let's to say good morning, everybody. Hey, I just want to let you guys know that we do accept stars, and the stars really do have us. Are they still around? around? They are still around. Okay. Uh, we had we 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 set up we set uh, um, an all time uh, high that if we could go ahead and reach that, we'll go ahead and do like a, a business party or something like that for everybody. But you know what? I tell you what. Every month, you know what we love to do. Way, we love party. to go ahead and do business mixers, mm -hmm. and I think it's a good for a good cause. But at the same time, you know, it's it's all for everything else. It's good. All right, I went there. I didn't say hi, but hello, everybody that's there. So I, I actually showed their best. Friday energy I, is I on did, the all time low, bro. I did show them on the screen. Thank you for showing up. And uh, you know, you, I, giving, well, you know what you should do is you should give away something today. I don't give away nothing on Fridays Why? besides Fridays. No, nothing. Was this like don't a you, don't you have like a corn festival or something that you have to give stuff away? I did that last week. Oh, okay. Dude, they, they actually had uh, uh, the BMX, not BMX stunt riders. They had actual motorcycle. That was riders. like lacrosse, right? Yeah, that's what that's called. Yeah, yeah. They had something going on. But uh, and then, so everybody knows. Speaking of something similar, uh, out at the Arizona Downs, they canceled the Derby uh, the for the fall. Oh yeah, they uh, sure did. They uh, said bye. Yep. So that's See not going to happen. So a uh, couple other things. So did you go to the Alice Cooper concert last night? No, I so, heard that was pretty people. awesome. You know what? What like I did Coulson notice is that night. everybody that was posting were around. Like, don't say it. Don't say it. Don't say it. A little bit older. Don't say it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they were a little bit older. Well, and they were like happy as that man. But then I saw. Um, I mean, he's always looked old. He has. Atlas but Cooper has always. That's what old. you get for living in Scottsdale most of your life. I think that's yeah. what you, that's from doing all the maybe the. Well, there could be that drugs. Yeah. <laughs> but um, so that happened last night, and I think we have Cole Swindell tonight. It's oh, like yeah, a country? country, yeah, country, yeah. I think it's, right. it's like some crazy, um, crazy concerts in yeah, Prescott. A lot, a lot of yeah. them. So let's go ahead and run down a little bit of what's going to be going down here locally and Prescott, Prescott Valley, Chino Valley. Um, you know, gosh, there's so many. Oh, all right, things. I mean, they, yeah, I put it into the thing that there was going to be some awesomeness. I think you just went over. That's about it. Well, and then also I got to ask is so remember the the thing last year with the the haunted house walkthrough? Is that done? They didn't do that again. They're not going to do it again. Okay. okay. Well, because I remember the first year you went, when you went down in the creek, and and your your it was awesome because your stuff started to cut out, and then it was creepy. <laughs> it was creepy, yeah. man. Mm -hmm. No, they closed that down. Uh, the 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 Yavapai County <laughs> acknowledged that they were doing it. They're like, hey, uh, they ended up bringing the fire department. They ended up bringing you know the the county, uh, and they're like, no, bro, you can't do this. You gotta have like literally like like builders come out to make sure the structure doesn't fall over on people. Well, that would be really scary. Fire. Which was totally fine, yeah. but at the same time, it was like, you know, you can't have anything fun unless the government wants to get involved. Gotcha. So, anyways, if you guys want to go ahead and know more about what's happening for this weekend, go check out it at the Prescott Times dot com. Okay. All right. So what what else is going on, Eric, in your life, man? I'm just trying to figure out like this weekend, I know there's stuff going on, but man. If to actually put your brain into it, yeah. I'm like, mm -hmm. yeah, it's been a long week. It is has been a long week. Uh, okay, oh, on Monday, uh, everything's supposed to be closed because it's supposed to be uh, Indigenous uh, Day. Uh, indigenous people. They day. changed it from it was Columbus Day, right? It was. Yeah, no, it was Indigenous it, people. So I did check because I got packages to send out. FedEx will still be open, so send out packages. Yeah, because they don't honor that. <clears throat> but the USPS will likely not be open. Um, so anyway, just as a heads up, if you're doing stuff on Monday and you're shipping stuff. You may chipping, not chipping. If you're mm -hmm. chipping stuff, chipping. All right. So just a little bit of rundown of all the uh, major news stories that are coming down. Three injured and off um, off highway vehicle rollover in Walker, um, and that's kind of a, a, a crazy little road up there in general. But needless to say, it happened. Uh, PNF will be closed on Monday, meaning uh, the Prescott National Forest uh, will be closed, and also. Uh, Chino Valley Police Department awarded Governor's Office of Highway Safety Grant. So what that means is that they are able to go ahead and not fix the roads, but they will protect the roads. Protect. Do you get that? Yeah. But like you know what? You we're used to make do? fun. You used to make fun of Prescott Valley and all their potholes. Have they fixed that? They do not fix that. Okay. I, and you know what? I've been driving down Prescott roads, and I have a motorcycle, and I get to see a lot more when I'm on the motorcycle. And I'm like, oh my gosh, there is like, you know, if, if somebody is swerving on one of our roads in Prescott, Prescott Valley, Chino Valley, it might be not that they're drunk, but they might have potholes they're avoiding. <laughs> it could be. Hey, I'm telling you what, Eric, there's uh, there's some things that I wonder about things, but you know what? They, they will go ahead and honor 
the the because we want to keep the road safe besides those potholes we want to go ahead and give them to <laughs> we want to go to the police officers so they can go ahead and give us the parking tickets and the tickets that need to be given to us well you know i think they've got like downtown they definitely slowed down the people parking way out in the lane like they're actually towing them and giving them tickets now. You see a lot of that. I, so it's, oh, it's yeah, downtown Prescott. Yeah, downtown Prescott. Oh, I don't think and, it, I think it's on the highways only. Oh, well, no. So on Willow Creek, Willow Creek's not a highway either. But I think that knock on I don't see any wood in here, but I was just be like, I think they've slowed down because they really got aggressive about ticketing people for speeding on Willow Creek. I think the accidents have slowed down a little bit. You know what I want to yeah. do? I actually want to go ahead and drive down uh the high uh, uh my my uh, commute from one side of the town to the next uh during different times. So this morning I came and a little do, bit and, earlier. And that, you should do it live and do it the whole thing. I, I know. I, 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 well, I got in trouble last time. So I was like, you're not that important to put it up live. I saw that. That was funny. I was like, you are so awful. Stop it. I thought that was I funny. I was actually focused on the road. I thought but that was funny. You know what I think that it is, is that people should, like, wh look what, it, what the difference is. If you guys, like, leave earlier, no issues. If you leave, like, as if you're, like, waiting till the last minute to get to work, but bad that's what idea, we're used to, bad right? Idea. Uh, but look at they're awful in Chino too, apparently. Oh, they are awful yep. in Chino. There, there you go. There, there are some roads in Chino Valley that makes me feel like it's just like a, a paved dirt road. Yeah, it could be. And it's hard. Well, man. like if you've, you, been to, if you've been to Jerome, they like you just put the pavement right over the uh, the uh, cobblestone from the you know old days with wagons. You see, it started like there's places in Jerome. It's the pavement starting to peel back, and you can see the cobblestone underneath. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. They, uh, they I, I don't remember what they actually had back there. But cobblestone. Obviously, cobblestone. Yeah, it's cobblestone. So, um, uh, look at that. She says, "Come and join uh the slaughterhouse for Halloween." What? What, what is that? Yeah. What is that, man? <laughs> Send me some information. You got a flyer? All right. What is? What is it illegal to have a slaughterhouse? And there's Gene. Uh, speaking of Gene and Haley, speaking of they, uh, 4-H started again yesterday for city for what Preston. does 4-h do for us uh they teach people about how to treat animals and how to how to raise them and, and how do to you have to uh tell the government that you have a um like like you have to tell them you have a garden i don't know <laughs> but they, they have gardens they've got sewing things they got all kinds of stuff but anyway oh, right. it was a packed house last night and i think they still have openings so if you want to get your kids involved um that's it's a it's a cool thing. It's is stuff. it free? It is. It is three ninety nine. I think so. And then there's, there's been thing. grants for it and things like that. But anyway, I, it was awesome to see pictures of the packed house last night and uh, for them to see that take off again. Oh, is that where you were? The last couple of I was not there. Oh, was it at what you call it? I was uh, um, uh, taking Kelsey to dance at. Uh, Let's oh, see. you went to the dance class, but you didn't go to 4-H. Right. I see where you're uh, with tra trading off kids. Yeah, I like that, man. You guys have a balance there. Okay, so guys. This is going to be a great Friday. Uh, it might rain and it might not. The only way that you find out is if you go outside and check the weather. All right. So somebody was asking the other day, and we got to probably do this before we jump, but when is the first frost? When do they need to think about that? Because we always talk about Mother's Day. It's safe to plant. Hmm. When is it safe to unplant? Unplant? Yeah. You got oh, yeah, yeah. to get it before the it frost. Should, it it kills be now. It's now? Okay. It should be now, man. I mean, we're not we're not seeing any, uh, like, you know, warm. And I'm I'm pretty sure that plants need to be in a steady like 70. Uh, but they, uh, 70. When, when it freezes, it freezes their water crystals, and that's when it kills them. So when's our first like 32? Jeez, 32 uh, low. It's gonna be a long. I mean, it's not gonna be until it's, like it's probably a couple uh, weeks. Into right? October. Okay. End of October, November. So, anyways, there's a lot of cool things that are happening. Just keep on following our page, and it's gonna be bigger. Um, you know, with suggestion from our friends at Northern Arizona. Um, uh, we we might extend the morning show, but this is how we're going to do it. We're going to do the first part right here, and then the second part will probably be San Martin's Corner. Cool. And at, and the corner, we're not going to be like. Are you going to look in the corner? <laughs> I mean, how's that going to work? Is that we're not going to be wait, 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 wait. And this is the first I've heard of this. So no, wait, we yeah, stick you in the corner. It is. It's the first thing you. It's the first time you've ever heard of it because I just announced it. To, right do, wait. So do we stick you in the corner? Like you have to face San the Martin doesn't go in the talk? corner. Nobody puts baby hey, in the corner. Right. And then you get like a dunce hat. Remember they used to do that. In like, you sit like in the corner. Yeah, corner. No. So what we're going to do on this? Squirrel too much. Corner. It will be. It will be Martin Squirrel Hour. I will run through some stuff. Maybe I'll even do like a. um like if you guys submit me videos and I'll do a live reaction do, uh, for the video, America's or Prescott's finest home videos. Or something. We could possibly yeah. do that. Yeah. Or, or I will go ahead and start interviewing people that are significant in the area and ask them real questions that I like to go ahead and ask people. And I mean, don't get me wrong. I like to go ahead and keep it fun and exciting, but sometimes we need to get down to the nitty gritty about some things. Like it is what it like is. Spicy food. 
spicy food. Okay. Like, do you guys want to try some spicy food? Yeah. If you want to try Salsa. some spicy food with me, or if you want to go ahead and be a part of that, let me know. Because I don't know if I want to do it every day. I think it's going to be like every other day until I can go ahead and actually have an um, a set calendar. But we're going to try to extend it for another 15 minutes in the morning so we can go ahead and let everybody know what else is going on. Nice. Well, cool. But well, with that, that being that said, see, is. Eric is already done. Well, see, it's been 20 minutes. I think everybody loves us. It's been 20 minutes. It's been 15 it's minutes been, right here. He well, says 15 it's minutes we're late. 47 six. because we're late. We're never late, bro. Who, who gives us we these time start limits? We on time. We, who, who gives us these time limits? What the heck? Who owns a watch around here? Uh, we both do. With that being <laughs> said, I'm out of here. Eric's out of here. He's already done with Friday. Eric, do you got a busy day today? Oh, yeah. I, oh, well, Gary said that he wanted to go to lunch. Yeah, I saw that. Eric, bring lunch to us. We're going to be too busy for you. <laughs> you better be watching. <laughs> you better be watching. He ain't doing nothing. He said he was going to take advantage of the day, the day of. He's going to, he said, I want to, <laughs> what he says, I want to be uh, the non working class. Non working class today. Yep. Oh, man. Right. With that being said, I'm out of here. Peace, love, and happiness. Let it not be war. Remember, love always wins. Bye bye.